Good morning, neighbor, and welcome. And we're going to start with Luke chapter 23, verse 33. And it says, And when they had come to the place called Calvary, there they crucified him. And the criminals, one on the right hand and the other on the left. Then Jesus said, Father, forgive them, for they do not know what they do. And they divided his garments and cast lots. And the people stood looking on, but even the rulers with them sneered, saying, He saved others. Let him save himself, if he is the Christ, the chosen of God. The soldiers also mocked him, coming and offering him sour wine and saying, If you are the king of the Jews, save yourself. And then an inscription also was written over him in letters of Greek, Latin, and Hebrew. This is the king of the Jews. Then one of the criminals who were hanged blasphemed him, saying, If you are the Christ, save yourself and us. But the other answering rebuked him, saying, Do you not even fear God, seeing you are under the same condemnation? And we indeed justly, for we receive the due reward of our deeds. But this man has done nothing wrong. Then he said to Jesus, Lord, remember me when you come into your kingdom. And Jesus said to him, Assuredly I say to you, today you will be with me in paradise. It's one of the most uh, talked about stories in the Bible, the thief on the cross and the crucifixion, of course. But as we read this, we have to really look at ourselves and we see Jesus' love as he dies for all mankind. We'll never understand uh, the pressure he is under as all the sins of the earth are poured upon him and still yet he can look with love and kindness at this thief and say, today you'll be with me in paradise. This man who is guilty you know, he, he knew he was guilty, and that's the a big, very big important part to realize I'm guilty. But then you look and say, there is a Savior who can save me. And uh, we have to look at our attitude a lot of times. Are we like Jesus, or would, are we just, oh, I don't like this, oh, this person, I, you know, we're always jabbing and poking at other people, looking at all their faults and their failures and even hearing that, you can look, yeah, yeah, people need to be more like, you know, be like, and they're, you're already looking at other, down on other people. But when I read this, you know, it's, it's the gateways, it's, it's love. This is the greatest love this world ever known. And we have titled this channel, Loving Neighbors. And hey, let us be like him. And that story really speaks for itself. Uh, yeah, in Romans chapter 5 it says in verse 8 but God demonstrates his own love toward us and that while we were still sinners Christ died for us much more than having now been justified by his blood we shall be saved from wrath through him for if when we were enemies we were reconciled to God through the death of his son much more having been reconciled we shall be saved by his life And not only that, but we also rejoice in God through our Lord Jesus Christ, through whom we have now received the reconciliation. We, through his death, we've been reconciled back and we have entrance to the father, you know, through his, through the blood of Jesus Christ and what he's done. But he also will tell us when he looks at us, are you greater than your master? Are you greater than me? I laid down my life for people. You know, I laid down my reputation you know, again, the scripture says he made himself a man of no reputation. He was the son of God. He made himself, you know, as if, you know, as if he was nothing. You know, and uh, that may not be the best way to put it, but he just said, you know, I will be a servant. And uh, help us to have this attitude. So we'll sing this song. Think upon this, these scriptures this day. And... It's hard to sing this song without getting emotional, so we'll try it. Jesus, you endured my pain. 
Savior, you bore all my shame, all because of your love. Savior of the universe, broken for the sins of the earth, all because of your because of your love because of your cross my debt is paid because of your blood my sins are washed away now all of my life I freely because of your love, because of your love, I live, I live, innocent and holy King, you died to Set the captive free, all because of your love. Lord, you gave your life for me. Now I will live my life for you, all because of your love. of your love because of your cross my debt is paid because of your blood my sins are washed away now all of my life I freely give because of your Oh 
enough and always will be enough so we thank you and let's just pray heavenly father we just pray that this little message will go out to the world lord and touch your heart that they will look to jesus and find their life so god just bless everyone i pray and be with them this day in jesus christ's name we pray Amen.